Nathizo released a bunch of great updates and today I'm going to talk to you about one of those updates. In Zo CRM, you will have a bunch of different fields that you can use in your CRM. One will be a single line for a last name, first name, short amount of text. One more field type will be multi-line where you can have a bunch of text, a few paragraphs or even more. Zo released a new update to this field and I will show you how it works. So first of all, let me show you what you have right now in the multi-line world so you will know exactly what I'm talking about. The, you have two types of multi-line. I will call it the dumb small and dumb large and you will see why. The small multi-line will have up to 2000 characters. So if I will go to this website, I will copy this text and you can see that this text is formatted. I will paste it in the small and you will see that the text is not formatted and it's all just one big bulb of text. If I will do it on the large, I will have the same result. Now, the difference between the small and large is that the small multiline can have up to 2000 characters and the large can have up to 32,000 characters. Huge difference. Now, most of the my clients will tell me, so Lior, why do we need the 2000? Obviously, I will always go with the 32,000. I have much more and it allows me to do many more things. They are correct, but there is one limitation. The small multiline will allow you to have different functionalities than the large one because the small one can have search on it can have you can add it to different type of areas in the crm and so on so the the functionality that you can do on the small one is a little bit different than the large one so the large one i would use it to store lots of data in my personal case I would use the large one to store log files. So let's say that I'm running an API between two companies. I would like to use the large one to store the log of the API in case that something is going wrong or there is some fu something funky going on. I would like to track what happened. So the log file will be in this file and then I can see what went wrong. The new feature will be the smart multiline. This is why I call the other to done when this is a smart one. If here I will paste the text, you can see that it's being pasted with the right formatting. And you can also have a bunch of more functionalities on top of it. Uh, from what I saw, almost everything that you will have in a basic editor, HTML editor, will be also here, which is very, very cool. Bottom line, you are able to have up to 50 thousand characters those will not be searchable and also you cannot have those fields in a view but you can use them for lots of cool stuff as an example if right now this is let's say a car dealership and i am searching for a car for this specific lead i could go here to this website i can copy the information i would paste it here and here you go Okay, so there are lots of usages for the smart multi-line. You just need to know when to use the small, large, or smart large. One more thing that I want to show you is really how to have this field. So let's start from the beginning. You will go to the settings. You will need to go to the modules and fields under customization. Then you will need to click on the module that you like to edit. In my case, it will be the leads. And then you will click on the layout. In my case, it's standard. And now you will see a bunch of fields. You can go to the multi-line on the top. You can drag and drop it into the canvas. Click on the three dots and go to edit properties. From here, you will have three options. The dumb small, which is 2000 characters. The dumb large, which will be 32,000 characters. And you will have also the rich text, which is 50,000 characters. And if you use that, then you can have the functionality that I showed you here. Okay, very, very cool. So try to experiment with that. I think it's a very cool addition in probably any field, any industry can take advantage of this feature. I really like it. 
and very soon I'm going to update you with another video about something that I can't really update you yet. I don't have the approval to do it, but it's going to be very, very cool. So it will be really soon. Have a beautiful day. We'll see you in the next session.